Okay. Hey guys. Um, so I've done a little bit of work. This is kind of uh, kind of the area that I had. I think last time you saw. Um, because here's that obsidian block that I placed like an idiot. Um, you know it's nice, kind of a feature thing. I've come to like it quite a bit now. Anyway, um, I have expanded my house a bit, and now goes all the way through the mountain, which isn't far. I've got my storage areas over here, and then I've got this lovely little. Um, window that looks out on a flower forest so that's neat um, I have done some mining I've got pressure pads for all of my doors because I am an idiot when it comes to shutting doors I am just so horrible at it um, so I've got two gardens and I learned uh, quite happily actually that this is the best way to garden um, because it gives you the maximum amount of gardening space per block of water and it is a block of water will reach up to four blocks away so you oh gosh I'm getting killed okay okay whew. that was ridiculous I have a mutton though so I can eat it and I forgot that bad guys are sometimes around um Anyway, okay, so um, you can do a nine by nine square and make the middle square four or five blocks in on both edges, uh, the block of water, and it'll keep all of the surrounding area wet. I accidentally planted a potato in the middle of my carrots. That's fetching. Okay. So I've got a whole bit, I'm gonna harvest those in a little bit. Um, but this side is gonna be, um, actually I probably should make it, I probably should make it beetroot and like potatoes and then, cause the beetroot is really obvious cause it's pink, but these two look pretty similar. Nah, what the heck. This is gonna be my carrot and potato garden and this one is gonna be my beetroot and wheat garden. So as you can see, I've also got some lovely livestock over here. I've got my sheep and my cows in one pen because um, I'll probably split them up eventually, if that's possible. And by split them up, I mean, you know, kill them all and get new ones, probably. Um, but they both are attracted to wheat, so I was just like, nah, put them all together. And I've got some pigs. I had some chickens, uh, but I don't know what happened to them hawks probably there also are horses wild horses hanging around here and I don't actually know how to get them how to like attract them into a pin or a picket or whatever I need for them so that's something I'm gonna have to research but right now uh, and what I was finishing up I I grew this lovely forest um, because I wanted to have a, a huge source of wood and then these, I what I did, I, I have played some versions of Minecraft before. Sorry for the horrible speaking, by the way. I played some versions of Minecraft before where um, you can put four together and it'll grow this huge tree. Like, they'll all grow together. Um, I don't think that's what happened. I think this is four individual trees that just grew really close together, but they're huge. And I was finding that um, because they were so like big you know and shady there were tons of bad guys that were just like hanging out in my trees um, so I'm coming through and cutting down the leaves yeah and there's a spider uh, I'm trying to cut down the leaves so I can at least see, you know, oh look, there's a skeleton in my forest. So that's what I'm doing now. Uh, I figured I would use shears, save all these for that hedge maze that eventually I'm going to make because I'm totally going to do that completely. It'll be awesome. You know it. And plus it just looks really nice. Whoops. Nobody invited you. I don't want to fight you with a torch. 
Okay. I think I've heard, actually, that in this recent version of Minecraft, there's something like you don't just spam with the sword to get the best results. You actually have to, like, do combos and stuff. And I need to look into that because I have been stinking it up with combat, as anyone can attest. So bad. So, yeah, that's kind of where we're going. I'm gonna run out of shears before I run out of these leaves. Oh my goodness, this is ridiculous. Yes, but I am quite proud of the leaves. Um, I've done quite a bit of terraforming in this area. <clears throat> Actually, this was not all um, flat, uh, but I made it flat because I like flat land for building on. It's very, very nice to have flat places to go. Um, So, but there was a pond. I don't know if you remember. Uh, there was a pond kind of in the middle, so I covered it over. I covered it over, and then I was like, yeah, I feel bad about like building anything on like one level of dirt. So I put flowers around where it was. So it looks nice. I have this little like fairy circle of flowers that's covering an underground pond. It's just a good deal. Whoops, where am I? Ah, no! <sighs> Stupid creepers. I hate creepers. There's a reason that I hate creepers. You literally blew up the wonderful little... Also, I'm really bad at noticing when bad guys are coming around. I was hoping that um, clearing these out would help with that. But I guess it makes it easier for them to see me as well. Man, stupid creeper, you blew up my tree. My, am I? Okay, I have too much. That's okay. I'm going to come over here. Put some of this dirt down here so that this is nice and flat again. Because this also got creepered. That's a word. You know it is. Whoops. I, didn't, I actually didn't want to do that. Okay. Well, that's lovely. Alright, so now, let me see. Ah, come on. Alright. Maybe that'll just be the disfigured tree. Um, I was hoping to put a ladder here, so I don't, I don't... I mean, it's not that much extra work to walk all the way around here, but, you know. Um, let me see, I was getting dirt. I have a lot of these oak leaves. It's very exciting. Okay. Yeah. And the, the beauty of the pressure plates is that I can press the door to open it, but I don't have to remember to shut it. Because I'm really bad at remembering to shut doors. So, yeah, that's nice. Alright, did I put 
pick up the flowers? I only got, what, four? Okay. I bet I can find four more dandelions. There's three right there. Okay. Oh yeah, there's four. Ah, uh, yeah, there was a lot of dandelions, so. Oh, goodness. I am pretty close to death, though, so I need to be careful. Did I get four or did I just get two? Oh, jeez, I don't even remember how to do this. I don't know how I did it. Probably like that. Okay, so it's nighttime. We'll go sleep and then, um, you know, actually, I think I'm going to go get started on the mine. I will sleep because I like sleeping. I have this awesome little bunk. Um, but I did make a mine. Um, I also made a little couch thing. Um, I don't know. Uh, I, told, I showed you guys the flower forest. I was really excited about the flower forest because it's beautiful. And I have sheep. Oh! That one has pretty much never moved. Um, I probably should go kill some of my cows and eat them. What do you, how do you cook beetroot? Is that a thing? Do you cook it? Excuse me. I, that was incredibly rude of me. Sorry, excuse me. Oops. Uh, I need coal. Coal is what I need. Okay. Do you cook it? No. I don't want to leave that in there. You don't cook the beetroot. Do you need to get a bowl? Is that, whoops. Please come here. Oh, nice. I thought there was a soup that you make. I know you can make a mushroom soup. Uh, let me just Google it. What do you do with beetroot? Excuse me while I Google. Minecraft. What to do with beetroot? That actually was the first result. <laughs> Before I typed the B. Um, Okay, so they make red dye. I didn't know that. Let's see, uses. Uh, they also can be made into beetroot soup. Okay, so they're, um, let's see, crafting. So you need six beetroots. Okay, so I just wasn't doing it right. Ah. Okay, good to know. So now I'm gonna try to eat some beetroot soup. Oh, yay. Okay, that makes me happy. And we saved the bowl. That's good. I'll have to make more of that. Um, I do wanna cook some mutton. I think my, I think my herds might need culling. I should go exploring eventually. That'll be good. But I also want to go um, mining. So uh, the way I set up my mine, I totally stole it because I thought it was really efficient. Um, because in addition to making YouTube videos, I watch YouTube videos. Um, 
I'm a really big fan of the Yogg cast, of course. Um, not that they care about my shout out to them. Um, I think they're funny and interesting. But this um, I got from <clears throat> a YouTuber whose handle is Wells Knight. Uh, basically, what you do is there's this giant hole that goes all the way down to level 13, and you fall into it, and there's water at the bottom, and it doesn't hurt you. Ta da! So I have this little room, and I don't think I brought. Oh, I brought plenty. Okay. I was gonna say, I don't think I brought any pickaxes. Um, and then, of course, there's this ladder going back up, um, which is a lot more efficient and fast than a. Um, like a staircase, which is what I'm used to. So I was excited about this, yeah. Okay, so I'm just gonna start uh, making this like main hallway kind of a thing for my mine. I would love to hollow out some of the world down here. Uh, find, a, find a cave, you know me, I like my caves. Um, so yeah. Uh, right now we're sitting on level 13, um, which is one above where lava usually spawns. <clears throat> so um, we shouldn't have too, mu too many problems with lava. Okay. And I don't know, I'm just really excited about this. So... actually goes back really far. So So and this is also his suggestion for strip mining. The same guy Wells Knight. Um <clears throat> because if you mine every third every fourth row then um, you have a pretty good chance of seeing all the valuable ores because they usually spawn in groups of at least two so yes it's a lot a very logical very um, methodical way of doing things and I quite like it so I do need to put like a crafting bench and you know, a chest and stuff down here with tools and everything because otherwise I'm going to have to keep going all the way back up to my house just to get extra tools. So. <laughs> it is a long ladder. It is a long way up. That's okay. Whee. And so then the idea was that um, I would also, whoa, oh, that's nice. Um, so yeah, when I'm coming out, these doors will shut on their own. It's very nice. I approve. That was a good plan. That was a good accidental plan. Um, let's see, I think I have an extra, oh, that's that was it. And I still have a bunch of stuff. I think I still have a bunch of stuff in my old house, but I'm not really too concerned about it at this point. Because I think I have most of the stuff that matters. Um, so yeah, we're officially, we're officially moved. We're not, we might go visit that swamp because it had a ton of um, clay to make bricks. Um, I should build something on that little hill there. That would be pleasant. I don't know what, um, but I should build something. Yeah. Anyway, um, I really want to get to where I am mining for diamonds and getting obsidian and getting into the nether. Um, because there's a whole bunch of stuff in the nether that I have never even tried before. And I think it would be neat. So, um, let's get, let's get some tools. 
Hmm. Let's see, tools I won't need. A hoe. Also arrows. Probably won't need an axe down there. Oh, if I run into an abandoned mine, I might, which I would love to. I think that would be so exciting. But nobody said I would, so. Still too many. Because um, I have a lot of the pickaxes. Actually, I'm going to do... I'm just going to make a chest. And take down there some required materials. Dang it. I don't want to do that. Okay. And we'll just take down there some required materials to make some stuff. I only have three iron. Hmm. Okay. So we'll go down. We'll go down in search of. <laughs> We'll go down in search of iron. We'll go down in search of, and I'm gonna probably have to build like a storage area down there too. Um, so yeah, that'll be good. All right, ready? Oops, I did it wrong. Woo! All right, so chest. Um. I only need one, not 48, that would be bad. Okay, so now I need sticks. Oh, and I did bring some coal, okay, good. Put that there, actually. I'm gonna put a furnace down here too. So that I can cook stuff. I don't really need dandelions down here. I don't know why the dandelions got stuck here, um, but they did. Okay. So, let's see. We'll need... I'm just going to make some more of these. And then some of those. And then I'll put the stuff away. Clear out my inventory. Actually, I should have brought some water. <laughs> um, I don't need the shears down here. Okay. Oh, and I'm going to make some more torches. So I don't need to do that. I can do the torches here. And I think we're good. Awesome. So then this would be, oh gosh, where is it? One, two. So yeah, uh, I am sorry if stealing this method of mining is like a horrible thing to do to my fellow minecrafters, but it's just so nice. I had one hit left in that gravel. That's funny. Uh, oop, there's some redstone. Oh, I'll need my iron pickaxe for that. So it sounds like we're pretty close to a cave, actually. 
Oh, I, okay. We don't have any sound because I turned it off a long time ago. Uh, I was gonna let it run and I didn't want the sound to bother my husband or my little boy. And so I turned it off and I've just been, oh, uh, that's lovely. Oops. This is taking, why is this taking forever? There we go. Yeah, that's a creeper. Oh man, how do I even, how do you even deal with creepers? All right, so I found this huge, big, lovely cave and I'm frightened to go in it. Man, this stinks. Okay, well, I'm just gonna, I don't know what I'm gonna do. What am I gonna do, guys? I'll just go down this way for a little while. It looked like there was some lava because there was some light down at this other end. So, let's see. One, two, three, four, five. Okay. Okay, so I found some more of the cave. Um, we're just gonna block it up. I, I'm just incredibly, there's a creeper. It's right out there. Guys, what are we supposed to do? Like, how are we supposed to deal with this? Like adults, are you, are you kidding, really? You could blow up and kill me, guys. Man, I am such a chicken. Okay, I'm gonna go upstairs and get more swords. Um, oops. Yeah, I'm gonna get more swords. And I think I'm gonna call that an episode for now. I completely forgot that I downloaded um, a texture pack. I think I might try to apply it if I am successful. I guess you'll figure that out. Um, so yeah, we'll talk to you guys next time. Thanks for hanging out. Um, see ya.